Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Okay, so today as you can tell it is an unboxing video and it is the January 2015 Bella Box unboxing. I should just let you know at this point I haven't done my December boxing as I mentioned in a previous video. I'm still waiting for it. It turned up with two items in it, um, a sachet I think from memory and a small product and I haven't seen the replacement yet. I did inquire yesterday as to where it was or a couple of days ago as to where it was. I was told it would take two weeks to sort and today or yesterday was three weeks and still no outcome so I'm a bit pissed off and this is actually my last month's box so depending on what is in here is to whether I'm actually going to even bother subscribing again. Uh, quite honestly I'm looking at violet boxes as an alternative because I think Bella Box has been a bit disappointing lately. Anyway, well, let's unbox this one and let's have a look. So I've just cut the uh, sticky tape and I'm going to just open the box. And okay, so there is no blue Bella Box like we normally get. It is just a box wrapped in a box, or sorry, a box with tissue paper inside it. So I'm just going to break the seal, grab the cards out. And now I'm going to move the box so you guys can't see what's in it before I do. So bear with me and I'll bring out each product one by one. Okay, so we've got the card. It says January 2015 Kickstart. On the back of it, it has all of the products. There is also this um, when card in there, which is a Bellabox special offer. $10 off and free postage and handling when you order the when 30 day deluxe pack, which is what's shown on here. Um, I don't know what's on the back of it. Oh, it's just the instructions on how to use it. Okay, so we'll get started with the products now. Okay, so this is the first product and this was our sneak peek for this month. It's a Lacquer & Co Lip Lube. This is a full size product. It retails at $24.95 and it is available from bellabox.com.au. It says a light glossy, glossy lip stick with a pop of colour, perfect for summer. The peppermint shea butter formula delivers an oh so addictive hint of mint and moisture with every application. A perfect addition to any lipstick wardrobe so let's see so this isn't going to be very strong color by the looks so it's just going to be a bit of a, a tint oh yeah practically invisible okay so I'm quite a distance away from the camera despite my hand looking huge and I can smell the peppermint so if you don't like peppermint you're not going to like this because it reeks um, it's okay it's a, if it's a you, you it's quite nice actually it, there's nothing wrong with it. it's quite a nice shimmery sort of peach color I do like this one um, I will give it a go but the peppermint is really overpowering so I'll see how I go with that one but nice packaging it's very nice it's sort of a metallic sort of um, rose gold packaging I guess for the color now does this wind up or is this a sharpener here yeah, so this is a wind up one as well so, so that's kind of handy Okie doke. So yeah, that colour is really pretty actually. If you've got a bit of a tan, really nice. Okay, so the next product is exclusive Bellabox makeup pouch. Retails for $7.95 and it's available from bellabox.com.au and it comes with this little card here. On the back it says Kickstart 2015 in style with your very own exclusive Bellabox pouch. This versatile cosmetic bag can be used for storing your favourite products at home or keeping, in your, keeping your everyday essentials safe in your handbag. This hot off the press product is perfect sorry, a perfect addition to any beauty lover's collection. Okay, so it smells. Okay, the first thing I noticed about that is it smells. You know that sort of, um, it stinks of pl that, that plastic smell. So it's quite a smelly th thing. Sorry, I don't know how to put that in a polite way. It, it smells. It smells plasticky. Um, it's got a very flimsy clip here, which will be fine, I guess, but I can see that coming off quite easily. Um, and to give you some idea how small it is, that is your full-size lipstick. So it is quite small, but I mean, obviously that fits in there and you can chuck a few hair ties or whatever. So kind of handy, but kind of smelly too. Okay, next product is by Brower. Now I have used some of their sleep products in the past. I believe a liquid sleep uh, drink thing and some of their herbal sleeping tablets with limited success, I will say. Now this is a Brower Calm Oral Liquid and it says, um, now let's have a look. This is a 20 ml sample. The recommended retail price is $20.99 for a 200 ml bottle. Um, improves your improve your beauty sleep with this calming liquid to help you relax and unwind proven to help you cope better with the effects of stress and provide temporary relief 
from symptoms, symptoms including irritability, re um, restlessness and insomnia. Now I get all of that, so I'd be very interested to see if this can do anything. Um, I just want to read the instructions because obviously it's, I'll also got to drink it. Adults and children over 10, over, oh, sorry, over 12 years, 10 mils. Children 6 to 12 years, 5 mils. It says initially take one dose every half hour for four hours. Then every four hours until symptoms are relieved. Shake bottle, blah, blah, blah. So basically, does that mean you've got to wake yourself up every four hours to take this? I'm sort of like, eh. Um, now let's hang on. I'll just open this and see what it smells like. Um, just while I'm having a sniff. Yeah, smells fine. It's just there's a subtle smell, nothing revolting. Um, if anybody has any good recommendations for something that will help me sleep that isn't some kind of prescribed medicine, um, I would love to know. I'm very, very. Um, I fall asleep fine, but my sleeping patterns are terrible. I wake up at say I'll go to sleep at eleven. I'll be up at two. I'll be up at four. 5.30 I'm awake and that's it so if you've got anything you can recommend it would be really really great now I have tried the roll-on ball the, the roller ball thing and the deep sleep pillow spray by this works it does relax me but again it doesn't keep me asleep so any recommendations would be much appreciated and I will give this a go and I'll let you know how I go with it I might actually just use this during the day because I'm not getting up every four hours to take it okie doke product number four you guessed it they've given us another Aveda sample okie doke we get these most boxes um, I have had I think at least six months of Bella boxes and I've got loads of these things between this and lust have it they must Aveda must be just throwing samples at every every product sorry every box that's out there um, but anyway, this retails for $79.95 for 150 mils. It is a body lotion, so a 7 mil sample is not going to go a long way. Um, it says, nurture your skin this year with this beautiful hydrating moisturiser packed with emollients derived from coconut, jojoba and other naturally derived ingredients to help replenish your skin. Perfect to rehydrate dehydrated skin during the summer. Um, yeah, look, it, it's, it, I've opened it up. It smells fine. Aveda products are lovely, don't get me wrong, but I'm sick to death of getting these stupid little samples. So we get them every single month. Somebody, I mean, you can go, the thing is, we pay for these boxes. And honestly, you can go into Aveda and get these for free. So this, to me, is a bit of a, well, it's not a bit of a rip-off. It's a big rip-off. Okay, so product number five is Wen by Chaz Dean Sweet Almond Mint Cleansing Conditioner. Um, it is a 60 mil sample, 350 mils retails for $34.95 at chasdeanwen.com.au. It says get fabulous hair this year. Oh, everybody's saying this year because obviously it's the start of the year. Um, get fabulous hair this year with this cleansing conditioner designed to hydrate and replenish hair without stripping its natural oils, providing added moisturizer, strength and sheen. Now... Um, it's a fairly hefty sample so that would do quite a few conditions so I will give this a go I have used when before but a long long time ago so I will let you know how I go with that one okay guys so the last thing in the box is an extra and it is a little sachet of derma heal balm 50 grams retails for $10.49 at Priceline um, I'm probably not going to be able to get a lot out of that. It's, there's not much in there, but I'll give I'll give it a go. I have got some dryness on my heels at the moment. Uh, it says visible re results in one day, which is really good considering how small that is. So, <laughs> um, okay, hang on, guys. I'll just get the box together and just have a bit of a chat at the end of the video. Okay, guys. So that's everything that was in the box. So overall, I think this is a oh, sort of fifty-fifty. Um, I mean, that to me is a huge ripoff. I can go into any Aveda store and get a sample of that for free. I can also probably go into a chemist and realistically they'll give those out for free as well. Um, so I do consider getting things like this in our boxes is a massive ripoff. We're paying for them and they give us these. So look, based on the last three boxes I've had, two of which have been full, one is, as I said before, I got one of these and a silly little sachet as well. And mm, three weeks later, they still haven't sorted it out. So based on that, I'm probably not going to resubscribe. I 
Um, as I said previously, I think I will go to Violet Box and give that one a go. Um, I have seen some other reviews of Violet Box and it does look really good. So, um, yeah, that's my thoughts for this box. And just overall, I think they're a bit bit shoddy lately. So, yeah, I think I'll give this one the... Um, the Heath Haven, I'll move on to a new box. There's also a box called Flora and Fauna that is a quarterly box similarly, similar to the um, Marie Claire parcel. Um, I think I'll be looking into that for the autumn box for that as well. So stay tuned and I probably will have a review of that up in the autumn. Okay guys, so if you've got any questions, pop them in the comments box below. If you like the video, please give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. Um, I do have a giveaway so I think it was in my last video there is a giveaway for a couple of makeup palettes so if you skip back to that have a look um, and just follow the instructions of the giveaway it's an international giveaway and yeah you've got a chance to win it ends on the 31st of January so yeah that's all for now guys stay tuned for my next video and thank you very much for watching bye